Hello guys and welcome back and I have quite a few empties for you guys so I'm going to do my empties video and I have my garbage bag ready so I can get this stuff thrown in the garbage. Okay so let's start with the Febreze small spaces. So this one Berry and Bramble I definitely could smell. They run for $3, so that's not too bad. It does not last for 45 days. I'm going to tell y'all that right now. This is like my third one. And two and a half weeks is about all I get. I don't even know if it's worth the $3 for the two and a half weeks. Um, I don't get 45 days. I still haven't figured out if there's a setting on here, a timer on here. Because there is a little clicker on the back. And I think I threw the other one away already. Oh, no, here it is. Okay, so this one I bought like two and a half weeks ago, and that's the berry and brandle. And do you see this is only how much that's left in here? And then there's this little thing on the back with a timer thing. I'm going to have to watch some videos and see, can you cut it off? Can you cut it on? What are you supposed to do? How are you supposed to get this to last 45 days? Um, because it has not been 45 days. However, however, for my bathroom where there are no plugs or anything in my bathroom, there's nowhere for me to put an automatic sprayer without it spraying in your face every time it goes off. Um, this is working for now. I can smell it. It works. When I walk in the bathroom, it smells good. It's great. And this is what a bathroom in my room. So for now, I will spend the $3. Um, a lot of times, Dollar General, which is where I go, or Family Dollar will have a coupon to clip for it. And so a lot of times, there's a coupon I can use for it. Okay, um, this was some premium Yanni soap by Goddess of the Sea Beauty. My sister orders from Goddess of the Sea Beauty. And a lot of times when she orders, she'll just get all the sisters a bar of Yanni soap. So I don't have anything good or bad to say about it. <sighs> My thing is, and I don't know if I'm missing something. To me, it's not something that I die hard need to have to wash with. So what am I missing, you guys? I mean, I understand what it does, and it's good for down there area and stuff like that. And, and I like the soap. But what is it supposed to be doing that I'm supposed to notice? Because the stuff y'all noticing or saying, I'm not noticing. I just think it's a good cleansing bar for that area. Um, I love the soaps. They smell good. Um, my sister said something about, oh, it's a good thing you're not having any more kids because those are supposed to be good for helping you have kids. I don't know. Y'all will tell me. Okay, I bought these lashes from the Dollar Tree. 686642. I like to say the number in case I forget. I'll go back and watch one of my videos. I like to know the good lashes that I find from the Dollar Tree for a dollar. It was called Chocolate Mousse. And you see I put a yes in there. These are 3D Fox Mink lashes. The Tony lashes are really... If you're ever in the Dollar Tree, grab you at least one pair of Tony lashes. You have nothing to lose for a dollar. They are really, really good. I finished Lyrics Rose Beauty Rose Water. You guys remember the video Lyric Rose is from Instagram. If you're not following her, please definitely go do that. She has a lot of items that are made out of real roses. And it smells so good. And I finished the rose water. And so if you're not following her, definitely go follow her and check out all her products. She has so many products. So many products. That's a favorite. One of my all-time favorites, y'all know. This is the Chamomile Lavender and Chamomile Aromatherapy Foam Body Wash. If you watch my channel or know anything about me by now, you know my staple body wash besides Dove is going to be the Aromatherapy Chamomile. And this is what I use all over my body. So definitely a favorite. I am going to go ahead and, and get rid of this. Um, this is the Sea Salt and Lavender Spray. Um... I can't smell it. I can't smell it anymore on me. It's just that light. I've mixed it with other sprays. Um, tired of using it. I'm going to see if baby girl wants it, but if she doesn't, then I'm just going to go ahead and get rid of it. I have so many other sprays that I need to use that I don't see wasting my time trying to use up this bottle. As you can see, I've used half the bottle. Fall scents and everything is coming out. I need to get rid of some of these sprays. It smells good, but not loud enough for me. Okay. 
this is some professional luxury dressage paris color shampoo you guys know i used to um color my hair all the time so i would use color treated shampoos they are really really good to get if you color your hair to use for shampoo so they're good to get nothing special about this brand just if you color your hair bleach your hair the way i used to with the blonde color when you get ready to shampoo and condition it's very good to have a color shampoo this one i would not run and buy again okay if it's in the semi semi annual sale i will this is the mimosa and sea salt but i've had better let me just put it that way i've had better most of the ones i grab are better i expected more out of this and i don't know what i expected but i expected more so the blue one i wouldn't grab again unless they put it on the semi-annual sale i finished this coconut milk and rolls by um victoria's secret i don't do too many of their flavors but when they do one like this i will try it and i actually enjoyed that it's supposed to be a calming um lotion and i actually enjoyed it it smelled really good it was a very light scent for me to wear to work um, my sister has allergies so sometimes i go light um when I go to work so I don't affect her allergies and this was a really good one so definitely check this one out you guys if you go to Victoria's Secret I liked it that one okay if you guys know anything about the wind company from I think it's HSN or QVC my mom had sent this to my daughter it's a re-moisture intensive hair treatment and sweet almond mint it is really really good I used it my daughter used it I think it was supposed to be more so for natural hair but I used it anyways because I'm like, any any hair treatment, you know, any hair treatment is going to be good for your hair. So, it's not a bad idea to use it, whether you're natural or not. And that was really good. I don't know if they still have this product on there or not. I know WEN, the Wynn Hair Company, was a really, really, really big hair company on HSN or QVC um, years back. Okay, so... The plugins. These are the plugins that I use throughout the house. Um, the Downy April Fresh I could not smell, um, but the original Glaze plugin and the berries. The berries seem to smell a lot more than some of the other ones. The Downy April Fresh I should have known wasn't going to be strong because this is April Fresh. Yeah, that's what it is, and so it's not going to be strong. I should have thought about that. But I use the plugins around my house. I have one in my room. I have one in the living room. And I just like for my house to smell good. When a candle goes out or when a warmer goes out, because um, I have the plug-in wax melt warmers, I like a scent to still stay in the house. So those are good. Just don't get a light one. <clears throat> I finished Jungle Lily. This is one of my faves, guys, from Victoria's Secret. One of my faves. This smells so, 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 so good. So good. There's a drop in there that I'm probably going to rub on myself today. You guys, this is the Eggs Fix... Oh, okay. Kiss Edge Fixer Gel in Maximum Hold. This is very cherry. I think I'm using pineapple right now, so you'll probably see that in the next empty video. I love these. They don't leave a lot of residue. I can put it on my hair all week before it washing my hair out. And you're not going to have a crazy residue behind it. So I really, really like these. <clears throat> Some more lashes from the Dollar Tree. This one, oh, I, another chocolate mousse. Okay, so obviously I like that one. Picked that one up again and didn't even know it. So y'all know, two times, y'all better grab it. This is a good one. Hot Springs Spa Eucalyptus. And the sleep, cedar wood and vanilla sleep. Two very, very, very good aromatherapies. I don't even need to go crazy about it. Y'all already know about the aromatherapy. Okay, this is the shaver that I use. You can find them at Walmart, Dollar General, and Family Dollar. Sometimes Dollar General will give you a coupon with it. This shaver is under $10. It is awesome for the down low area. It has a small side and a large side, and it doesn't really cut you if you slip up and go too deep or too far. I already bought another one because this one stopped working. I've had this one for about two or three years. You can take the head off and clean it. I keep an old toothbrush to clean it. 
Um, I love that. Clinique. All about clean liquid facial soap. I prefer the gel. I think I told y'all that before. Or the foam wash. But honey, you can't say nothing bad about Clinique. Clinique gets it in. That's what Clinique does. This is the Derma. Is there anything left in there? No. Derma Color Fix. Now, see, this fixing spray is what like drag queens and stuff use. What I don't like about it is it's an aerosol spray. It will stay. It will last. But it's an aerosol spray. Hold your breath when you spray it. Because it's an aerosol. So you definitely want to hold your breath when you spray it. Um, I wouldn't buy it again just because it's an aerosol. If it came in a spritz, I would. I got some old makeup here that I have used up. In the NARS, I am in Cadiz. And this one was too dark for me, so I was mixing it with something else. This is a Maybelline Matte Poreless. That was too dark for me, so I was mixing it with something else. I finished, this is, I had to finish this. This was some years ago. Lavender and Cedarwood Olive Oil Cream. Y'all remember when they had that packaging? I had to just go ahead and finish that. Um, I finished one of my hand sanitizers. I finished the You're the One Fragrance Mist. I finished the coconut cream. This smelled really good. Even if you don't like the smell sweet. And I'm kind of getting away from that too. I don't want to smell too sweet like candy and stuff. But that smelled really good. I would get that again. That smelled really good. Now one of my favorites. Tutti Dolce. One of my favorites. There's some left in that. I'm going to mix these two together and get that out that bottle. Okay. I finished my Morphe setting powder. I was trying to stand this up for y'all, but it don't want to stand up. And all of these things that I'm telling you about right now, I don't have anything bad to say about y'all. If I do, I'm going to tell you. This is what I use for my brows, the Maybelline Brow Extension Pencil. It lasts all day. Um, this is not the waterproof one, but it does last all day. I can sweat. I can kind of rub my face. And my brows are tattooed. But any areas that I feel like need to be a little bit darker or that may be fading, I will put the brow pencil over. This a Bite, Bite Agave Lip Mask. Grab it, go get it, grab it, go get it, go get it and grab it, go grab it and go get it. Okay? And then I'm just going to tell you all about these last few... I'm um, waiting for these to go back on sale. So these are the wallflowers that I like. Cinnamon stick. Watermelon lemonade. This one I could not smell. Lemonoso. Somebody suggested that. Maybe it was me. Maybe I'll try it again. But the lemon limoncello I could not smell. Sweet cinnamon pumpkin. Yes. And we're in the fall. So I need to go over there when they put them on sale again. Y'all hit me up if y'all see the sale alert and I don't see it for the wallflowers. $3.95, whatever they is, y'all hit me up. DM me, tag me on Instagram because I am out of wallflowers. Um, to me, they're not worth the money. So I only buy them when they're on sale because they're not worth a lot to me. They're not worth the regular price, definitely. Okay? Definitely. And if I can get a free breeze plug in for three dollars i'm gonna get that over the wallflower because the wallflowers they're hit or miss they're definitely hit or miss but if y'all see them do the sale holla at your girl all right see y'all next time